Family accident. Mechanical worker Glenn Nix was killed Wednesday when the cap blew off of a pressurized pipe. News of his death is hitting especially hard at the city of Tallahassee, where he worked for years before taking a job at the Mag Lab last month. Fox 49's Julie Montanero has this story. It's just hard to take that, you know, he's gone. Kent Tebow worked with Glenn Nix day by day, side by side in this truck for years. The two spent each day sending this robotic camera into city sewer lines to check for trouble. Tebow tried calling Nix when he heard about the Mag Lab accident, but he never got an answer. It is just hard to deal with, you know, being that he was, you know, the last, well, I was the last person he worked with here, you know, before he left. Nix was killed Wednesday, just four weeks after taking a job as a mechanical trades technician at FSU's Mag Lab. A spokesman says the crew was trying to remove a steel cap from a pressurized pipe when it blew off and struck Nix. I just pray that it's not really true. Wow. And then I thought, well, I just prayed that he didn't go through any pain. Um, and. I thought about his family and his kids, and I prayed for them as well. To hear you know, a tragedy like that, somebody that you work with right beside each other and talk to every day and spend more time with him than you do your own family, you know, it just, it, it was really, really hard to hear something like that happen to me. Everyone at the city of Tallahassee's underground yeah, utilities fights back happened. tears as they talk about the man they call Nick, who they say loved his wife and children and could fix just about anything.